Hi, welcome back to Dave's MySQL Basics. Now, this is the um, series for folks who want to learn how to use MySQL and structured query language. The first issue that most people have when they're trying to learn a database is some sample data. Uh, today, you're going to see how to do that. We're going to use the popular World Database, which has been around for a long time. Matter of fact, the data inside of it is kind of uh, well out of date, but that doesn't mean it's not a great, great teaching tool. So. We're going to connect onto the server, and I'm going to log in as root on my local machine. And the first thing I'm going to do is go into SQL mode. Now I'm going to do a command here. You can do it yourself uh, if you already have it preloaded. If not, um, you can use this handy because you can practice getting rid of it. I'm going to drop schema, S-C-H-E-M-A, and world. I actually preloaded the information and this will go out and go to that. Now I also could have typed drop database world. Uh, it's not there so we're going to get an error. Now now that I have the uh, machine uh, database server ready, I have downloaded the data already. Uh, a little bit later you'll see a link on the instructions for doing that. Uh, besides what I have here, there's some wonderful written instructions for a whole bunch of different operating systems. Plus the download link to actually pull down the information. Uh, the, the, the World Database comes in either a zip format or a tzip format, so download it to your system. If it is not already uncompressed, please uncompress it. So to load the data, I'm going to use the source command and then I give the path. Now if I was on a Linux or a Unix box, it would start with that, home user Dave. But I am not on one of those machines. I am on a Windows machine. I've loaded the uh, downloaded file to the scripts directory, and it's called world.sql. That stands for Structured Query Language. Now this will go out and load all the information. I uh, might notice that warning. There'll be another warning in a second. This is actually going out on my very old arthritic machine and inserting all the data. This takes just a moment. And this is inputting the records. And once it's there, uh, we can see what's in there. So if we type use world, that sets our default schema to the world database. I can type in show tables. We have three tables. Now, in a couple additional episodes, you'll see how to use the various commands, select, update, delete. Uh, but if you want to actually take a peek at the data, you can do select, that's the L-A-C-T, star, which is a shorthand or wildcard for everything. And we're going to go out that, that from the country table, where we don't want to see 239 different countries. I'll dash across my screen. I'm going to do a limit of one. That's a modifier to the select command. And instead of using a semicolon, I want to see that horizontal, so I'm going to use a backslash uppercase G. So here comes the information on where and how to download this information and install it if you haven't been able to follow this.